please a man. The attractive level of that guy, the attractiveness level of that guy skyrockets. And most guys don't understand this. Yo, what's up my inspired alphas? Welcome back to another video. Today, we are talking about the most misunderstood concept. Let her come to you. Make sure you like, make sure you subscribe. Let's jump into it. Now, let's clarify one thing. We don't chase women. We never chase women. We only pursue women who who are into us, who are interested in us. Now, let's talk about, you know, the four reasons why why you should do this because it it is so easy. Number 1. Number 1. It is easier. It makes your dating life easy. You see, most people really don't have a clue why some people are successful with women and other people are, are, are struggling. Now, keep in mind, you will never attract every woman in the world. That is the reality. Every woman has her own preferences. Now, you understanding the type of women you attract makes your life easy. And once you know that, hey, I'm an attractive guy, I can focus on other things and still get laid because there are women who are interested in me. So you deal with the women who are only interested in you. And this, well, through my experience, I've come to realize that the women that I have called approach for are the one who, sta who started the initial interest. They give me a lot of hard, hard times compared to the women who, you know, they are the ones who choose me. And where, I'm, where I am right now, I, I cannot deal with women who are, who are not interested in me. And it makes life so much easier because you will not invest a lot of time, effort, money. Because she already likes you. She already likes you. So guys, don't chase women. Pursue those women who show interest in you. The women who are already interested in you make your life better, make your life easier. That is the secret number one. Let her come to you. Let her come to you. Don't go to her. Let her come to you. Letting the women come to you sets the power dynamics. Now, relationship is all, is all about power dynamics. Now, there are two types of relationships. The one where the guy has the power and the one where the woman has the power. Now, when you let her come to you, she's setting the tone that, hey, I want your guidance. I am coming to you. You know, I want your leadership. I am going to submit to you, you know, to, to whatever it is you want me to do. And there is the other, there is the one where the woman now is, is the leader. She says what she wants to do. She tells the guy, this is what I want you to do and what not. Now, when you look at these two relationships, which one do you think they, they are happy? Now, and in this case, I'm talking about feminine women and masculine men. There are women out here who, you know, they love, they love being in power. And I don't judge them, it's them. And there are men out here who like being submissive. It's them. I'm talking about a world where there are feminine women and masculine men. In, our, in, in this world, or, or in this situation, the guy who is in control, in that relationship, they are both happier because it is it is a man's nature to be the head, to be the leader. It is the woman's nature to be the nurturer, to be the care, the caregiver, to be the you know to be to follow the the, the leadership of the man. Everybody gets a hit of what they are supposed to get. So when you decide to go chase a woman who is not interested in you then you must submit to her because 
now you have to give up your value because you the way you look at her you are signaling to her that hey i don't think i deserve you so i am going to do anything to hit it and that is just a that is a mindset that is for the weak men the weak minded men strong men know that i cannot take any bullshit i know who i am and i know that hey i can survive without women but women make life you know they add color to life so it's all about knowing that i don't chase women i don't chase women i only pursue women who are interested in me number 3 now women will please you when they come to you you see the reality of the world is that when a man tries to please a woman the attraction level falls when a woman tries to please a man the attractive level of that guy the attractiveness level of that guy skyrockets and most guys don't understand this that is why i tell men when for example in the bedroom you should you should not be so eager to go down on her let her be the one who is you know who wants to go down on you because she wants to please you she feels like hey this guy is so high value i have to i have to be on my best behavior whether it's in the bedroom or whether it's out here and remember women are attracted to the guys they want to please because that is the feminine nature they want to take care of you they want to make you feel happy but the world out here right now the reality of the world is that the modern people the modern society is is advocating for men to you know to go out of their way to make women happy and it's destroying men it's killing us men out here because that is not the way it's supposed to be done it's not the way it's supposed to be done and it is going to it is going to backfire and bite us in the ass because nature there is no vacuum in nature nature always balances itself but if you are among the few men who understand female nature if you are among the men who know how to behave how to act accordingly you'll find that your life becomes so much easier because now women want to please you and i'm telling you the when when you have a rotation of women who are highly interested and want to please you they are in, in some kind of competition guys i'm telling you i don't think <laughs> i don't think there is a better feeling than that well unless you are well i don't i i don't know I've, i've never been in any committed serious relationship but i know that when you have women who are who who are you know who put you as a priority pleasing you is is a, is their priority it 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 changes the view of the world and it makes everything so much simpler last but not the least guys this helps you become cool calm and collected guys most insecurities when it comes to women come from the pressure of trying to be perfect and trying to be fa- to be perfect is all about you trying to make a woman happy you want to see her laugh you want to i don't know you want to do this and that that is what gives you those insecurities because you are you are you are you 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 have embraced or you have adopted the feminine qualities that she supposed to have we let the women let the women be nervous around you let the women wonder what am i going to do to get this guy's attention but when you are thinking you are cracking your head open thinking oh my god what am i going to do to get her attention that's it 
that's it. It's all about, you know, re relax, cool, be cool and calm and believe that you are enough as you are. Just that, just that belief makes the difference because people perceive you the way you perceive yourself. So if you look at yourself and you're like, I'm good enough the way I am right now. I am the best version of myself right now. And I am the most, you, you act like you are the most attractive guy in every situation that you are in. People will look at you like that and they will wonder what is it about this guy. Just because you are cool, calm and collected. The fact that you let women come to you, you it, it means there is a lot of free capacity or free space in your mind to think about other things. So guys, that is the concept of letting women come to you. Hopefully you got value from today's video. Make sure you like, make sure you subscribe. See you in the next video. Peace out.